we should never sing. Let's just state that. We wouldn't be allowed to know what's Hello, going please. on in my mind. Probably don't. not. Please it's a don't. dead donkey with flies. Champ, sorry, around. I know you're in the zone <laughs> and you don't need to hear the sounds of Levi singing. It's appalling. Like someone stepping on a cat, as I've told you many times. That's a compliment for me. <laughs> Actually, yeah. Um, how are you feeling tonight? Back in the saddle? Yeah, oh, not too bad. Any too words bad. of advice from your daughters? Your dad, you could have bought this, could have bought... Well, you bought everything, let's face um, it. Just keep winning. Okay, good. Good Dick, plan. Good Works, that one. Let's see who you're up against tonight. Good luck. Our first challenger plays touch rugby, hockey and netball. She also writes music and insists that she can recall every single meal that she's ever had. Uh -huh. From Brunswick, please welcome Eleanor Williams. Is that so? We'll find out. Hi, Eleanor. Hi. Our second challenger is a human resources consultant who wants to travel the world. He's recently discovered a passion for counselling and plans on getting a psych degree. From Northcote, please say hello to Peter Knight. G'day, Peter. G'day. I understand you're a twin. Are you, are you the better looking? Pardon? Are you the better looking of your twins? I am the better looking. We don't look anything alike. Really? OK. Nothing and smarter? We'll find out. It would be good to have twins on to see. It That's settle family That's arguments, would great idea. It? Well, let's cash up Peter on his own and right. uh, Eleanor and Dom and get into it. $20 for everybody else. Ethan. OK, here we go, players. What do we call the education of boys and girls, or men and women, together in the same... Eleanor. Co-educational? Yes, or co-ed would have done too. For three years, until 2003, John Stevens toured with which band as its replacement? Dom. In excess. Yes, yes, after noise works. Which homophone is both a dish of ice cream with ingredients such as fruit, nuts and whipped cream and a day of the week, Peter? Sunday. Sunday on both counts. Let's buckle up. Our first sprint for tonight. 20 seconds goes on the clock and it starts now. A Christmas tradition is to kiss under which planet? Eleanor. Is it okay? Yes. Fictional character Clark Kent works for which metro... Dom. Daily Planet. Yes. Which UK band's debut album was Please Please Me? Eleanor. Beatles. Yes. To be recklessly determined is to be what bent? Peter. Hellbent. Yes, ambassadors and governors are addressed as your what, Peter? Excellency. Yes, playing Mickey Spillane's Mike Hammer on TV with Stacey Who. Before the Hooter sounds, Stacey Keach we needed. Everyone firing on the buzzers. You're hot tonight, you lot. Eleanor, Peter, a share of the lead, 35 to spend. You can be tempted when Lavinia says the low price and walk away with this. Peter or Eleanor, here's a piece of art that looks as good on the floor as it does on a wall. This handmade wool and silk rug has been made according to strict century-old traditions, so it has the ability to add a sense of warmth, beauty and history to any room. Valued at $2,900 tonight, it's looking especially good at just $6 from Bijan Exclusive Rugs. Well, you always see these rugs discounted, don't you? It's hard to pay full price for a Persian rug. Who's up for it? Eleanor, Peter, $6. You're thinking it's a question in a little bit, aren't you? <laughs> yeah. Five dollars. Lean One on question. that thing. Eleanor, Peter, Do you'll have something the twin brother doesn't. <laughs> hey, you say, look what I want on the show. Going once. Oh, Eleanor, good. good. You can show that to your sister who was on the show a couple of weeks ago, right? Well bought. By what nickname did we know the Australian cleaning products entrepreneur who died in 2000? Peter. Be careful. Big Kev, I'm excited, that's right. Unlike other muscular tissue, able to conduct electricity, like nerves, is the myocardium, the muscular part of which, Peter? The heart. Of the heart, you are right, and up to 45. $10 into play, it's a first look at our famous faces. Who am I? Born in Sydney in 1952, I studied law at the University of Queensland and graduated with arts and law degrees before earning a master's degree from the Queensland University of Technology. I worked as a solicitor at the Supreme Court before being elected to the Queensland Parliament as member for Brisbane Central. And I served as chairman, Peter? Peter Beattie. Peter Beattie's quite right, yes. There we go, Peter. Your namesake gets your first look at our famous faces. Here they come. One of the great actors of our time, William H. Macy and Bobby. Getaways, Natalie Guzleski. Is it a bird? No, it's Ben Affleck playing TV Superman in Hollywoodland. Freedom Writers star Hilary Swank. From The Good Shepherd, it's Matt Damon. With a little razzle-dazzle, Nolene Brown. Jeff Daniels plays Alvin Dewey in Infamous. Is it really her? Yes, Jessica Biel in The Illusionist. And Mike Munro. Go, Peter. First look. The prizes or cash. William H. Macy, thanks. Isn't he a ripper actor? Here he goes. For you, Peter. The turbo. Or chance to round things up a little when we come back for round two. Got a handy lead already, up to 45. Eleanor and Dom on 30 apiece, and that's where we leave it. More temptation after this quick break.